Hello Star Wars fans and toy fanatics, Steve here with your friends and thank you so much for taking time out of your day to join with me as we take a look at some more Star Wars action figure goodness. Today we're going to take a closer look at the new Jack Specific 31 inch Stormtrooper. Now this guy is absolutely huge. Uh, very very cool sculpt. Um, you know, very uh, true to the original trilogy Stormtrooper in my opinion. Uh, just an awesome, awesome figure with only one major drawback. And that drawback would probably be space because these guys take up a lot of space, man. And uh, that's probably the only thing I could think that would be wrong with these guys because they're just absolutely huge. But the sculpt is very, very cool. And uh, it does come with seven points of articulation, which is awesome as well. Uh, just an awesome, awesome addition if you're a Stormtrooper lover like me. I uh, could not help it, man. These guys, I just love Stormtroopers, and I just could not help but add this guy to my collection. So let's take a closer look at this guy and uh, give you a little more detail on exactly what we're getting here. Uh, going handheld here, so forgive me if I get a little shaky on the camera there. Uh, let's take a little zoom in on that helmet there, which is actually done very, very nicely, in my opinion. Uh, it's got some quality paint applications on there. As you can see, very, very nice looking. The only thing I could say probably is the helmet is slightly, maybe ever so slightly smaller than on the body than it should be. Maybe just a little bit bigger as compared to the whole body, but still looking very, very cool. Again, it's got some nice paint applications. Very, very cool looking. Um, might as well get a shot of the back of the figure here for you. Now the only uh, there's slight hindrance with the screw holes, but you know, still very cool looking. You do get the thermal detonator in the back there. Of course, the other molded parts there as well. And of course, you got down to the legs there. Very very cool. Again, he does come with seven points of articulation. You got a swivel head. Sorry, it's a little tricky here. <laughs> you do got a swivel head here, uh, swivel on the arms. You do have swivel on the wrist as well, with swivel legs, and that's pretty much it. Now, he does come with a pretty cool looking blaster, very nicely molded. Uh, no weathering or anything, but still very cool looking. And it is molded to his hand, but still, it's got some nice detail on it. It looks very, very cool. And again, you do have the swivel action on the wrist there. It's a little added plus. And uh, the detail on the belt and everything looks very, very nice. Again, some more paint applications. Looks very, very cool. Again, this guy is absolutely huge. Very, very cool looking though. Uh, nice sculpt in my opinion. Very nice. Very true to the original trilogy Stormtrooper. So that was enough for it to warrant a purchase for me. And uh, why be happy with just one Stormtrooper when you can have two Stormtroopers? <laughs> yes, I had to get a second one because you just can't have one Stormtrooper, man. You know, you need two, right? They got, you know, you got to have somebody to talk to, I suppose. So I got two of them. And these are retailing for about $29.99 at Walmart, and they're available right now in the new Rebels section. Very, very cool. I just had to get two because the only way that I thought it would look cool is to accompany the Darth Vader figure is with two Stormtroopers by his side. And to me, that just looks pretty, pretty cool. Very, very awesome looking. The only thing is, guys space but that is a good problem to have no worries I'll figure something out I'm sure but very very cool looking Stormtroopers highly recommended for anybody Star Wars collection you know concerning if you have a little space to uh, give up for these guys because you're gonna need it so thank you so much for joining me today guys and as for the DVD of the day today I'm recommending none other than X-Men Days of Future Past I just finished watching this movie It's very very cool it's great to see some old characters introducing new characters. Story's actually done very well. You know, a few little plot lines that I was kind of a little confused about, but still, I enjoyed this very, very much and highly recommended. I didn't get a chance to see it in theaters, so 
finally get a chance to see it is awesome and I enjoyed it very very much so that is my DVD recommendation of the day check it out if you haven't seen it and if you have let me know what you thought I'd like to know so until then my friends thank you so much for watching have a great day and of course as always happy hunting